Hello everyone, we are back with Stranded Alien Dawn, which is finally fully released with its new um, new scenario, which is Military Outpost. Uh, Military Outpost is different than the other ones in that it's a lot more focused on defense base building and large creature attacks, um, animal attacks, fauna attacks, what have you, whatever you want to call it. A little bit different than trading outpost where you're trying to make money and, and gather resources and sell them. Uh, military outpost, um, here, let's just dive right in. Um, same scenarios, moons, and all that other stuff. We're going to do uh, the Sobrius and the Concordia moon, which is just a you know typical one. Um, the game rules will just do big family. I don't want to uh, I don't want to make it too hard or too easy um, for us on this run, but um, game difficulty medium. So yeah, let's just dive right in and I'll kind of explain as we go. So big difference is we get six survivors. Um, I'm going to kind of go over little tips and tricks that I do for these. So remember, this is military, so there's going to be a lot of combat. So we really want to avoid people that don't like combat or people that can't do combat, um, other things, slow pokes. I do not, I have no time for slow pokes. Same thing with vegetarians, uh, no offense to vegetarians out there, but really, um, it makes it really difficult if you're in a pinch and you've got nothing to eat besides meat, especially when we've got, we're going to have so much bug attacks. There's going to be so much extra meat around. Um, it's going to be a really big part of what we do. So, uh, Bloodlust is good. This guy's really good. Very combat um, oriented. We'll pick him. Um, let's see. I like Quinn as well. Quinn, pretty good at uh, construction and crafting. Um, and he's a cheerful personality. Those are really big things to have. We really need um, some folks that are good at, we're gonna be doing a lot of construction, especially right off in the beginning. Um, so I'm looking for at least like a two or a three construction on some of these, um, if we can find them. Here, she's pretty good, but refuses to eat meat. So I'm not a fan. Um, I do like Simon, Simon's a fast walker. Um, that's really big. Um, his bleeding, you know, he doesn't, this is a really good guy to have for combat situations, especially he's good at combat. Problem is, does not like construction, but intellect, we can use him elsewhere. We really need some construction forward folks here. So let's see who we can find. Man, they really, here we go. So permanently decreased happiness. Um, I think we can deal with that if we've got a good good construction. Um, let's get some ladies in here. We've got farming, healing, intellect, but rest twice as slow. Like I said, I try to avoid stuff like that. Um, Lara's pretty good. Let's see. Fuse of me. I know I've already looked at a couple of these. Um, I do not like Annette because she's slow. Permanently increased. All right, let's go with Emmeline. Um, ooh, a light eater. Can't fail a medical treatment. Let's go with that. All right, so we got our six. Let's get started. Okay, so we're going to get dropped off here. They're going to shoot up a bunch of flares, which... Oh, I'm next to a big body of water. That's different. Haven't had one of these seeds before. Um, I just love the terrain um, in this in this game. It's just, it's just phenomenal. Um, the devs did an awesome job with this. So let's see here. Um, I always try to survey the scene. We've got some a lot of good resources near us to be to start off what i'm looking for here is also a big flat space too um the way we're going to do our base is going to be a little bit different than the trading outpost scenario um and all that other like 
uh, we're just going to be doing things a little bit different here. Okay, so first thing, I always pause. Um, let's pause. Let's look around. Okay. Wow, we we got a real good setup here, um, and also we're surrounded. So we're on the the low ground, which isn't you know this is actually nice because we really can't get attacked too much from this area. And actually, we can. And this is what we'll do. We'll back up our fence, our gate, our structure to this. And that's just one less area that we can get attacked from. And we're going to kind of funnel in. Yeah, no, this is really nice. OK, perfect. Um, all right. So first thing we want to do off the bat is we want to get a few, um, a few things always stockpiles. Okay, so because we're going to kind of back up to about here, um, this is going to be in our way, so we'll probably do, okay, so we're going to do, although the, hmm, might be a little difficult though, the way the, uh, the way the tiles are, so we may have to kind of go somewhere like that, which is fine. We'll figure it out. Let's see. Let's get some stockpiles. Okay, I like to start with that. And then I always just get some sleeping spots, just so... Or not messing with that. Um, we'll observe you. Definitely going to need some silica, I believe, for this. So we'll observe those guys. Um, densely leafed plant. I'm not sure what that one is. Let's see. I don't know what the wide leaf is. I'm not really interested. See this thing, you gotta kinda I'm not super interested in like tobacco and stuff like that, because we're not really gonna be messing with that. Um, bright leafed plant. And then my biggest uh my favorite thing is mushrooms. Um not the tube mushrooms, but the the glitter caps. The glitter caps are just awesome to have because if you all you gotta do is put them here we go put them under a roof and they are good to go uh, indefinitely so you're not here that should be enough um, to get started with let's also start cutting trees down this is tough we don't have a lot of trees here we're gonna need a lot for what we're trying to do Maybe we observe that mushroom instead of the one way over here. Okay, good. Looks like it took care of that for us. All right. Now let's get someone scavenging too. Ooh, lots of blade grass. Um, we don't need that much. That's another thing I, I find that I end up doing is cutting down way too much. Ooh, tall leafy. That's going to be grain cob. We'll need that for antibiotics. Um, antibiotics are huge. Oh, there's a whole other one. Let's scavenge you too. So yeah, we're going to, just because I'm going to kind of keep the way we're looking at this going this way. Um, definitely want those cut down. All right, let's see, shelters, let's just get something above those. 
Chew root. Hmm. That's a new one. I haven't seen that one. Interesting. Now uh, let's get a rock or two just so we can. Where's that interesting rock? Let's observe you. I know there's a shiny rock in here too. Where are you at? Right there. Let's observe you as well. All right. We can make those cool. Okay. So I want to get a workbench going. Okay. Let's see. Want to get one of those desks. A workbench. Um, research desk for sure. I'm going to get that stuff going. We're going to basically clear out most of this space here. All these skin barks and all that. Um, You know what, I am going to observe these trees because we may need to plant more. Um, wow, yeah, there's not a lot of, we're going to have to be really, a lot of rock though. Maybe we make, hmm, yeah, okay. Maybe we make our perimeter with stone. probably do that okay so something else they give you a lot of electronics and a lot of food so you really don't have to worry about food in the beginning uh, which is really nice um, but you want to keep everyone happy so let's make a table and then we'll get some chairs is that one two three four five I want one more chair Try to get one for everybody. Okay. Awesome. Okay, so we're gonna harvest these and then we're probably gonna cut them down. Someone's got okay silicone deposit. All right, ore deposit. Let's craft some veggie leather. Okay. So here's something else that I forgot to do. These activities, let everybody do everything, at least in the beginning, switch here. So veggie leather crafting requires at least a crafting of two. So what I'm gonna do is make it so we're building up our, the people that that have low skills, we're building those up so they can at least do some things. Um, two constructors is fine. Um, farming and planting is going to be, we're going to, we'll figure that out. That'll be okay. Um, and then research. Simon's good for a lot of things. So let's get, um, no, Quinn needs to do construction. Yeah, let's do Katina on research for sure. And I always just do two. I don't put them at one right away because I want to save that for things like like hunting. Um, 
for example, like if there's butchering that needs to be done. Um, so yeah, we'll put that. And I, like I said, I want to get the people with low skills up. All right, let's see. We got one crafter. We got a researcher. Let's go. My Katina. Yeah, her farming. Let's get in there. Let's see. Okay, so another thing raw food we're gonna copy those restrictions we don't want anybody eating raw food all right okay let's get a campfire going And then just for a minute here, I'm going to have somebody just do delivering so they can move stuff around. Doing little things like just getting these tables up is just really helps keep everybody sane for the beginning. We'll harvest those, the ones that are ready. Okay, we don't really need to worry about food for a while, so we're not going to really worry about getting that going. Okay, so housing. A wooden plank room, interesting. Is that a prettier wood? I guess. It's the same. Okay. We are going to, like I said, because the way this is angled, We're probably going to build Okay, yikes, that's a lot of wood I just want it big enough There we go Oh good, we got a bunch of trees back here. Okay. Oh, lovely. Thank you for that. Let's see. Let's research lightning rods. We'll get that going. Um, also, like, spaceship deconstruction just gives you a lot more 
There's a lot more stuff you can get from there. Um, let's pause for a second. It's always nice to pause sometimes and know you're not screwing things up here. Um, chew root oil. Oh, we can make oil. Okay. Here, let's harvest some of these just to see what Okay, lightning rods. Let's not deal with that again. A couple of fallen trees. Okay, there we go. Thank you, Simon. I wonder if we could do six. Um. Yeah, let's do sticks. You know, if everybody... Just kinda, just kinda give everybody little bunks. Ooh, let's do doors. That is six. Okay, that'll work. Cool. All right, Raka, I think you've made enough. So your crafting's now at three, so we're going to take you off of that. You can do something else. Like maybe observe this tall leafy plant, because we really need that. And we need these glitter caps. All right, first aggressive, of course, it's behind us, Jesus. Okay, so let's pause. Everybody is going to need a weapon. Okay. Can you need to equip that? Fleeing danger. Oh boy. All right. Or 
or you can just go right there. Here we go, animal attack. Oh, I didn't equip anyone with spears. That's a big, it's going to be a problem. Yikes. Luckily, we got some impeccable healers. everybody. And just have people heal themselves. Maybe not. Alright, Simon reached healing too. Good. interested as to how this one got in there. But oh well. Alright, storage. This is a big part. You gotta get good at making these little enclosed spaces. So, we're also gonna want small windows. For each room.
grain cab. Let's see. Hmm. How much of that do we have? We've got 110 veggie leather. All right, let's harvest all of that. Ooh, and then let's get some mining. Yeah, we got. We are blessed with all of these rock chunks. And then we're going to harvest the cloth blossoms as well. And then some grain cobs. We'll just get all that. Oh, that's nice. A lot of fuel. Good, good, good. Okay, so another thing. Because we have so many electronics, we can really start. Like I said, we want to keep all of this stuff... close. I like solar panels because you know they're going to work during the day. Food fabricator. This is crazy. I didn't realize you can... Electric furnace. I do want a furnace. Like I said, we keep everything real close so they don't have to run far. And then we're going to get, oh, perfect. Look at this lovely, we're going to get a field going there. A little bit of this chew root going. I so said, we don't need a lot. We don't really need a lot. Um, and then cloth blossom. Mainly the cloth blossom is going to be for making bandages. Okay. We need more wood. All right. Okay, now, all right, let's pause. Now that we have things that need planted, this is what I like to do also, is everybody is on plant duty in the beginning. That way you know you're getting a good, clean plant. Everybody, you know, everything's getting planted at the same time. Um, so you'll have like even harvest because it's really annoying when you're harvesting like one third or one fifth of yeah. See, this is great right here, and you want to keep these small. You don't. We don't need a lot of resources because we're not trying to make money here. Um, so, Quinn, let's get you constructing that. Do not have enough storage space. We can get another stockpile going just for kicks. All right. Perfect. We're already using it. Simon, I'm going to borrow you.
got a grain cob, chew root, cloth blossom. Okay. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Because now we have, let's do that. So who's a cook around here? Emmeline. All right, girl, you're up. Just get somebody on cooking all the time. And that way they're not eating up all of our emergency rations. We can save some through winter if we need them. Yeah, here we can do make them sleep. And then we'll do relax time. All right, speaking of, let's get some leisure going. Dartboards are huge. Everybody loves a dartboard. And then a punching pole. They adore the punching poles. I do that right there. Okay, man, somebody needs to get on this guy here. Simon, I, I need these mushrooms observed. Let's harvest those. All right, big evergreen trees. Where are these guys? Okay, over there. All right. Why do you still not have a weapon? Okay, so we want them to sleep a little bit. They're all in the same spot, which is nice. A little bit of sleep going. Okay, draft. Let's go right there. So there's flying ones here, which is different. Flying ones are no fun, but they die pretty quick. No oh, good. There you go. Okay, now that we have these, big thing, we want to get all cooked meals, raw fabrics, electronic crafting, apparel weapons, medicine, out of there. We're going to copy those restrictions and paste them here.
Let's see if there's any nearby trees. We don't have to run all over the map. Uh, there's one here. There's a few here. All right, I'll cut those. All right. What we can do is make it so some people won't eat that. So they're just eating the meat, the meat meals. All right, let's see, furniture. Okay, now let's see. Why just wooden? I don't want wooden. We can do a fence. Let's do a stone. Can they get around it? Tina, I need you to cut this tree. Thanks, Quinn. Aha, shroom torch, perfect. That's what I'm missing. Um, yeah, I got time to do one glitter cap run.
Ooh, I have been really bad about research. That's something I need to keep going. Um, let's see. Churute oil is going to be big. Insect fat. Antibiotics. These little things that are a few hours, definitely want to do that. Get that stuff going first before you eat it up with, you know, a three-day meat printing deal. Oh wow, 11%. These are growing real quick, which is nice. Can I move these? No. Alright. Let's get some new stockpiles going. And we will keep empty. Same rules here, we don't want cooked meals. Um, we can keep crafting materials there, weapons, medicines. Then we're gonna copy that, paste it. I'm okay with raw food. Cause if you're putting raw food in here, you're, you're really eating up your, uh, your space, at least for now. Nice, good job, Ken. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, there's plenty to mine. Production oil press. Big deal. Big deal, the oil press. Toxic ash. Oh, that's fun. Cut those, get rid of them. Okay, good. We're researching bandages. Here we go. Let's make. lot. Okay. Um, I don't want to make 
and just out of veggie leather. Sorry, Simon. Not really worried about this. There's going to be plenty of it. Now let's keep raw food out of there. Fine, we'll take raw food out. Now we can probably... Beautiful. Okay, let's see. Heat it up. Okay, so same thing with the planting. We want everyone to harvest. All right, antibiotics production, fermentation barrel. Actually, let's make them out of scrap metal. Usually not a fan of that, but wood is very hard to come by here.
All right, guys, so we're going to stop this video here. This will be part one, but big takeaways are small base, small area um, for the military outpost. Don't really worry about food in the beginning. Um, you're going to want antibiotics production, so grain cobs important. Um, these shrooms are important. The glitter caps, I'll get into that in the next episode. Um, get a battery, get it charged up, because um, it'll it'll come in, in quite it'll come quite in handy when you need it. And then um, use your resources. So we didn't have a lot of uh, wood, so I didn't make any. You know, I didn't construct anything out of wood, or I didn't make my big fence out of wood, which I usually would have done. Um, but that's okay. So, oh, hey, let's butcher that guy. Um, remember, you know, get everybody on planting, everybody on harvesting, so that you've got everything coming in and out at the same time. We're just middle of summer, so we can probably get at least one more rotation out of here. Um, you know, out of all the... Uh, what am I saying? Out of all of the crops, you really don't... We really don't need a lot, Um but, uh, yeah. Other than that, guys, we are going to stop it here. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you liked it. I'm going to keep posting these. We'll, we'll keep going.